Hello and welcome back to Hearts Find 4 with our Mongolia campaign. Alright, so let's uh, you know see what uh, was up. Uh, first of all, I want to apologize for the fact that there was not a episode uh, 12 hours ago. I was really tired from a long day and uh, yeah, so that's kind of what happened. And actually a little bit more. There we go. Um, so yeah, let's... Uh, Get this shit on the road. So, I'm gonna train a lot more troops to put on the... 50 of them are gonna be put on the border with Japan and, you know, uh, Transamur and the uh, these guys. Um, the other 50 will be put here on the co uh, coastal defense line so we can actually put up a minor defense um, against the Japanese. Because that is our next target, the Empire of Japan. Now, one problem that we're going to have is the fact that the Empire of Japan actually has a decent navy. Our navy consists of um, nothing. So that's a good good prospect. Okay, just a sneeze. Sorry, I'm still a little bit having a little bit of a cold. And we need to find the places for steel. That's annoying. It seems like the world is not really willing to trade any steel with anybody. So we uh, definitely are going to need to uh, put our next uh, researches in the gaining of more materials. And there's also another reason to expand maybe slightly further into uh, Japanese territory. Alright, so we cannot fully build all our little tanks. Actually, it's mostly I think our ships that are currently uh, biting the uh, bullet for this one. So how much are slowed down? At 35%, it'll slow us down. Lack of resources, another 60%. So yeah, it's gonna take a while to produce those destroyers, which is a little bit annoying. Well, that might actually mean that we need to produce steel factories, which is not really what I had in mind. Um, nor, nor is it not really what I want to do. So more factories is... Is it really necessary to build that much more factories? Not really, I'd say. He's gonna skimp a little bit on this. So we build all of those, so... Okay, we'll put all that up. That's fine. And... Yeah, we're, um... I'm gonna do some research. And, uh... The Batavian Commune has capitulated. There's just a lot of it happening. Now we've all of a sudden got another Italy set up and we still need Serbia to die. Uh, but that needs to be done by the Kingdom of Ukraine, which probably in all likelihood is not able to set up against the Commune of France. So that's something to look forward to. We should really get try to get friendly with the Commune of France then. Nah, we still lack the uh, territorial access. The king lands. The king have been defeated. Uh, no. We'll uh, occupy the territory ourselves. Get a little bit of a... You know, point there. I don't want the puppet. Okay, well. A little bit of stability downfall. Not the worst thing ever. But we're going to take our time to uh, rebuild. So, we claim the German colonies... Uh, let's see. I think I own most of them already. Uh, not all of it, but some of it? Yeah. Let's see what this results into. Okay. Um, yeah, so far so good. I'm sorry for being incredibly sniffly. Just having a bit of a cold. Which is actually lasting for bloody ever, which is a bit annoying. <laughs> but yeah, what are you gonna do about it? Annoying thing is, Japan is actually giving me license productions and they have the more modern ships. Which really, really annoys me. Mexico. Uh, damn it, nobody can keep up with my need for oil. It's annoying. 
But what you gotta do about it. So we're gonna need to, we are going to need to build steel factories. I think at least a couple. Let's take a look at the resource map mode. There is not really a uh actually. We might want to invade Siam, because there is some steel there, plus a lot of rubber. So it get us a lot of rubber. Um and the Bahar Marjong commune seems also not like a bad target. In fact, they've got a lot of uh, steel as well. I wasn't really planning on going that route yet, though. But we might need to get there a little bit sooner. But I want to actually like, at least get Mountaineers before I go there. Because our tanks will be... Actually, once we push through the mountains here, our tanks will be fine. Uh, they will not suffer, though, in there right here. You're around your own little faction, so by taking you out, that just kind of gets rid of that little piece. Might not even be a bad idea. And then we can take the Kingdom of Siam if we really want to be desperate. German Empire against Mongolia demands our colonies. Well, what are you going to do about it? I am ten times your size, buddy. At least. Alright. So they went to war. That's definitely not what I expected. Well, Germany is capitulating and dying all over again anyway, so... Uh, well, well, Germany. That's not what we were... Th wasn't the plan, buddy. That wasn't definitely wasn't the plan. Well, just uh, our tank divisions will take quick uh, care of a lot of this. Germany only has 61 divisions left, which mostly are fighting, in all likeliness, in Germany. Um, so... Okay, so we just gone... ...to war with the entirety of Middle Europa, which is a bit not definitely what we had in mind. Well, damn you, Germany. That means that we are at war with you here? Um, yeah, Middle Europa. Oh well. I think this is a war we can win, so let's uh, ship over the forces. And uh, yeah. Not what I had in mind, but uh, eh, it works. Project is, is ready, so once again it's time to get some more resources out of the ground. Um, take care of that, will you? Thank you. Delete your orders, because you don't, you don't need to go back there. Um, and half of you will be put here. There we go, and let's see. Just quickly take care of that, please. Thank you. All right, well, we'll be uh, sitting on our... Uh, Macau, let's see, where is that? That's Portugal. Well, let's not go to war with Portugal just yet. I think Portugal is alive, yeah. They're not in a faction, but they will most likely join a faction. Well, Brazil goes to war. I don't know the Philippines were in this, though. Let's take a look. Who do we need to beat? The German Empire. Okay, that's it. Okay, that's that sounds easy enough. Alright, just uh, quickly clear this out, will we? Just to ensure that there is no funny shenanigans going on. Okay, another research for that going on. There we go. We got some unassigned tank divisions, which can immediately go to this little war. At least I believe those are. Yeah. If they're deployed in twos, they are from the other uh, army division. Um, right there, okay. Um, troops are still arriving. We just need to push in. Right along that line. I think France is gonna love us for it. They might even, you know... Yep, they will license us uh, ships. And we will no longer be... Ah, they will not accept, damn it. Tech difference. Ah, well. Can't have it all. Alright, that one's done. 95 days for this one. 
pretty nice. Just set up the defense line and uh, we'll... Uh... Wait, are you at war with those guys as well? No? Okay. Um... Then why the hell did you did not connect this up? Really, that's... Oh, Jesus, sometimes. I did use the bubble. Yes, I did. Alright, I mean, I'm no longer trading oil with... Uh, them so we can trade a little bit of this here we'll trade a little bit of say i'm here i can put an access here so let's fix that um minor deficit here we'll trade 30 more, more with france we'll trade a little bit more with you trade some more with the other germans that should fix that problem all right and uh you guys just uh just go defensive because that's kind of what i was had in mind for those armies anyway so let's go defensive get the last resource uh, researches and uh, okay you go here and be assigned there will you okay the rest of you you should have orders oh wait but I don't think you understand your current orders as well as you can and then we'll have one here I can go down the coast up to this point. Yeah, you can do that alone. I think you are strong enough to do that. And then you guys will connect up here. Um, no, that's the wrong thing, though. Ah, well, I heard it will work. It will all work. It has to. But so far, so good. Is there anything I can invest in air bases and <laughs> it's just air? Mongolian Navy has never been an idea. Uh, what does this do? Oh wow, that is brutal. I don't even know what it exactly will do. It gains, I gain a couple of claims, but yeah, I need to do a lot of it. I'm, I think I mostly just need to own everything here. Uh, Manchuria, yay hole, where the hell is that? So, okay, that will give us the um, war claims on those. All right. Um, really, is this now German territory? Oh, this is so confusing. I think you can go to this army piece. Um, wait, the four of you. Go down, get the German colony under our control. How much kind of resources does this give us? A lot of rubber. Okay, that guy kind of gets rid of the rubber uh, trade that we needed to do. Um, okay, the armies have arrived and they are doing really well. Good. Um, for now, you will all um, just immediately get assigned here. Let's change the deployment point as close as possible. What are the roads looking like these days? Uh, they're not too bad. We still need to win this war though, so... These guys should be fairly good at defensive uh, stuff. So... Uh... Alright, okay, we're fucked. That's bad. That's really bad. And with being really bad, I mean, oh my god, we have a serious issue. Um, okay, I cannot settle my laurels with this. Uh, I need to push in now, and we need to start... I will... The fuck am I gonna do this? Um, okay, I need to really quickly clear up the German crap we've got going on over here. But really quickly, I mean, this should be done already. There we go. Okay. Go and speed the fuck up. And... Yeah. Well, you guys are no longer going to get assigned to anything, so... Uh, just start pooping them out before they're ready. Because... Uh, Okay, you guys get in there. 
you guys just need a front line. So the new army is already being made. Hi there. I need a new commander. Uh, there is no level 3 guy, so right, uh, for now, go. Um, I will promote you later. You'll become, I don't know, blue. Nice color. Go, immediately. Your deployment zone also is changed. Let's see, let's go to your 5. I just... Uh, we create a couple more divisions. Restoring eastern borders has been bypassed. Strike of Manchuria has been bypassed. Wait, restoring eastern borders? Oh, we just... Alright. Alright, so we are, have we have a little bit of a little bit of trouble. My tank divisions can clean this up uh, a little bit quicker. That would be great. So everybody joins in the war. Not so great. We need to get rid of the German threat, which is, like, a serious issue right now, because that kind of occupies a large portion of my army. Okay, well, that's, so far they don't seem to be really that aggressive. Good. Okay, let's clear this bit down here. Okay, the reason why I'm clearing this bit down here is very simple. I don't like the idea of having an open front line that I need to pay attention to. Um, so, and I don't even know... See, the, the big problem is I don't know which territory is mine or which is theirs, because we have the exact same color, which is really annoying. Okay, whatever. I don't know how that works. Um, just get fucking rid of it. I think if my tanks can get there in time, we should not have that, that much of an issue. And so far, they seem not really that hellbent on advancing. Good, good, great. Tanks are just cleaning up. You can just take that real quick. Okay, not there you go. Pushing at the last bit of Germany in Asia. All right, good. So we can now see there's just one German province left right there. That's it. Okay, good. So you guys, uh, I hope you are can set up right there. I need one of you to just quickly take that German province because I. I'm getting annoyed by it. So move over there. And then attack. Alright, that should take care of that. Very nice. Alright. Oh boy. Um... Okay, we can start skimping on the trade already. Good. We just need a large chunk of oil. Trade with Mexico has been cut off. Why? Close to our economy. Right, and trade like this is not going to help me much. So I might need to do this. I need also money to oil. Damn it. I need land trade routes. Well, let's see what we can get. There we go. Anyway, um, all right, tanks are moving. Good. So far, Japan doesn't seem to be really involved in this shit just yet. We've got to modify our government. Let's go to good stability. Increase our factory output and everything. How are we doing? Okay, so we're kicking the ass out of uh, uh, Ukraine and Germany. That's good because we don't have the equipment to hold on both. Please capitulate Germany, somebody. I think Germany should be considered capitulated already about a long time ago. So people are cancelling the non-aggression pacts. Okay, as long as this army is doing its thing, I am fully happy with the result. Alright, uh, you can go on blue, get deployed. We mostly just need bodies at the front line right now. Warm blood at the front line, that's what we need. Um, we're 945 already. Uh, my voice is cancelling out. Great. Okay, so some minor attacks are happening here and there. Um, but our tanks are still just arriving at the front line, so they're defensing. They're not really that defensive just yet. I haven't changed your deployment point. Shit. Alright, you need to be get promoted. Well, congratulations, General. I don't know who of the generals you are. But I think you would do the trick. Yep. There we go. 
You have a large army. Get, you know, prepare yourself for it. The old nine yards. It's mostly the tanks just doing the defense right now, which is definitely not great. Um, so let's do a little bit of counterattacking here and there. You know, get some of these units. Uh... Alright. Um, blue, you're... Need to do something like this. I want you guys to just strike on that. They're not set up to do this properly, but for now, this kind of has to do. Alright, more tanks just arrived. Two to be exact, but they are the new tank core. Um, tank, tanky, tank core, you're going to be yellow. And, well, as we don't have really any level... Oh, you do level 2 commander with tanking skills, good. You don't even have your tanking skills yet. Panzer leader. Okay, excavation. Um, there we go. Um, these will deploy to Mongolia with automatically added to you. And literally deploy like on the front line here in Tenjin. Tenjin. Add to this armored core. There we go. Yeah, this is literally panic playing. This is like, oh god. This needs to be fixed yesterday. Um... We don't need our new tanks. We like my new tanks though. Um, they're gonna make a lot of a difference if they're ready. Or when they're ready. Alright. Um, 12 of you. Really? Half of you. Go back here. And keep on the push. Just keep pushing. Alright. Excavation's ready. So at least the resources are fully in order. That's just a good thing to know. Um, this is not important as anything else right now. Um, we're good on that one. I don't really need my nuclear research right now. Um, I don't also need my industry. I just need... Yeah. Winter attrition, summer attrition. That will actually help us. I need things that really just put me uh, defensively better on the map. And it looks like we are holding. Right, panic deployment by the Mongolians led to barely being able to hold on. Oh god, and luckily we have the production values to uh, even run like this. Uh, it's, it's... We're not in a good spot, not yet. Um... I'm expecting a lot of trouble from Japanese invasions later on. That's still kind of the big fear. Um, that if I don't really... Um, I need to win this war with Germany and Ukraine all quick. Because this is... You know, this is going to be... Where the fuck are you not... You're not allowed to invade from there. Good God. They're not allowed to... Uh, we have no military access with these guys. So we cannot attack. I think they're not theoretically from them. Or they're not at war with... Are you not at war with Germany? Oh, no, you're not. Okay, that means money spent a lot. Alright, there is another excavation. And let's get some advanced desert and jungle clothing. Because there will be some desert fighting and everything. Alright, just start taking names, people. Um, it seems like the lines have mostly just crushed. And this would be the point where I would really like my... 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 My, uh, my motorized horses. Or my armored horses, steel horses, whatever you want to call them. Okay, but there's no Russian army left. Or uh, Ukrainian army left. Kingdom of Ukraine, capitulated fully. Great. Um, exactly what we need. Right, now set up like that. And... Ram as much firepower in that direction as you can. Thank you very much. All right. Hi, France. How are you doing? Um, shaking hands with the French. Um, let's get Minsk to capitulate as quickly as possible. I think, yeah, okay, these guys are put on highly aggressive. So we might have lost a lot of manpower um, purely on this war already due to the highly aggressive push we made. Actually, we barely lost anything. We, we almost lost more. Did we lose more? No, okay, we almost lost more against the... Uh, Japanese already. All right, well we got that capital. No, not much will remain from uh, White Russia, which just gained a lot more territory for fuck's sake. 
I don't know. Okay, which war am I now fighting? It's this one. Right. Um, White Rift through Ada is almost done. Don't do that. Because you cannot attack from that point. Okay, just you. Go to Riga. You. Go over here. You. Go over there. Gotta get half of you to go over here and here. Just... Go, go, go. I need to get this quick. Okay, enough attention on that front. Right here. Oh god, we got some breakthroughs happening. Um, not a good one. Okay, nope, nope. Okay, this is not really going that well. Deploy more shit on the front line. Okay, uh, more forces will be... Should be flowing in. We're now already at 50. Right with the end, I capitulated. A large chunk of stuff. Oh god, this is... Not looking good. Because it's partially going to Russia for some reason. Um, that doesn't really change the orders that much. Alright. Um, what does change is that you guys don't need to be here. There you go. Big downside to these guys is that they're highly inexperienced and they suffer some terrible modifiers on that end. That's kind of the only way I think we can currently do this by. Just get as much shit on the front line as possible. Hopefully we'll be able to hold. Our tanks can do a little bit of counter pushing. Because I, th he, it feels like he is... Um, yeah, okay. Our tanks need to push back in. Because he's currently pushing way too much on the other side of things. So if we can have a little bit of work down here. They don't really want to do this just yet. Um, but I think it's important. Just to uh, show them that we are capable of holding our own and that they uh, should probably not think that we are a weak nation. Mostly seems that um, these guys, uh, Transmur, are the ones that are doing a lot of the pr uh, pressure set up right now. Um, if I can... I actually don't want the attack here. I want the attack here and here. we we'll cut off at least some of these troops. So by crushing in here, hopefully we'll take a little bit more of a defensive posture and we can at least get some... Uh, how much do we need to deploy? Like 20%, right? Okay, when the red army is here, um, blue is gonna go um, take to the, uh, the coastlines and red is gonna be the one that's gonna do all the other ones. Dorpat, okay, take it. Um, Libau, take it. Um, we need Königs back, which I think is one of the final German... Uh, actual German places except as well as Danzig. Is Irish forces here? I really don't really expect them. Okay, everybody just... Uh, I don't know what's going on anymore. Uh, why do I have a front line right there? We don't need it. Okay, uh, you, Konigsberg, take it. Danzig, go, take it. It's important. Go, 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 go. Speed is of the utmost importance. We're no longer fucking around. We are in a hurry. Ah, this, these frontline orders are just incredibly badly drawn. That's not really helping. Hopefully I can get this over with. I'm... Ah! I hate the fact that I'm fighting on two different ends of the world. Alright. Um, okay, there's an opportunity here for surrounding some forces. I'll probably am bleeding tanks in a too much rapid succession. Yeah, so the attack of the tanks needs to stop. Because I cannot afford to lose any more of them. Okay, pick, pick up defensive postures again. Did, however, stop the enemy's um, aggressive advance that they were doing. Where are a lot of those forces? Anyway, who cares? Get into Danzig. That's the only thing that matters. Jesus Christ, got 12 Irish divisions here. Uh, six Irish divisions here. Five Irish divisions here. Okay. They're bailing. Good. Advanced winter clothing. That helps on the defense of everything. That's ahead of time. That's industry. Let's see. Heart attacks. Not really what we need. A heart. I'm getting one. Things keep going like they are. 
still need my mountaineers at some point. Well, let's get a little bit deeper entrenchment. Finally, you know, getting it done. Or it doesn't seem to like anybody is in Danzig. So, the Irish are retreating. Get into Danzig. Okay. Please. Move faster. No, 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 no. Stop it. Assist that attack. Danzig falls. Germany will capitulate it. They have to. They have nothing left. Um, third war? Nope. Middle war. German Empire still has everything. Like, wait, you... They don't have any victory points, so... Oh, God. That is... Not expected. So... Germany, what do you even still own besides Danzig? Just that's it, right? Oh, wait, you're gonna say that I need to conquer all of these German fucking colonies to get them to even consider capitulating? Well, at least I get them out of fucking Europe. Um, and this threat will be done and dealt with. Um, it's not ideal, but... Ugh. You know, you gotta do something. Alright, how's the other front looking? Not good. Could be worse. Guess that's the uh, best description of it. You should not get any tanks. Um, yeah, we're running out of tanks. Uh, I don't... I don't... I, we can't produce any more. Because we don't have the... Um, oil for it. Well, I can at least make sure that the, what we're producing right now is at least getting something. Alright, research for refineries and steel factories seems that we're gonna need that. Uh, how are we on steel? Okay, we're really good on steel. Good, we don't longer need as much. Could you stop trading? Oh, good god, so we just need oil. Great! I don't know what gave us a lot of steel, but uh, I'm glad that it did. Let's see if I can just drive in there. You know, if you're not going to stop me if any doing anything. I just don't want to put any pressure on that front. Um, just yet. Alright. Um, so all of you should be assigned to here. I'm just going to ram ourselves straight through. I doubt that this should not... This is not core territory. Did they consider this core territory? Really, I highly doubt that. No, I actually can't see that. Alright. Because uh, um, No, I could see that. Yeah, they consider this core territory, so we need to invade in Germany. African Germany to get them to capitulate. That's just silly. And we need to come down hard on the Irish. Strangely enough. Anyway, with that, I'm actually going to end the episode. I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one. Have a very good day. Bye-bye.